Okay, is it really that bad? Yeah. Ow, oh, ow, there's glass. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. It's coming out of that leak. Yeah. Hello folks, we are, I'm alone, no one's with me right now, but I'm supposed to have a teenager in the car with me for her ortho appointment and she came down four minutes before we were supposed to leave, not dressed, not teeth brushed, and she hadn't even had breakfast yet. Here she is. Okay, let's take her to the ortho for the first time in four months, five months. She was supposed to have an appointment right when all the quarantine started. Will you get the garage door, Kaylee? And then I'm going to get that mop head taken care of, get my hair cut. Kaylee actually says she wants a haircut, but I can't get a hold of the hair salon. And I'm not paying the prices of the person I'm going to for her. <laughs> Sorry, love you, but not that much. Go ahead, put it on. Is it your first time wearing a mask? No. No? I, you haven't gone out very much. I don't go in stores. No, she hasn't, hasn't really gone. Have you ever gone in a store? No. <laughs> I don't think she has. She has no desire to leave the house for the most part. So she's here for her ortho. Oh, so you call and then they, they're they ready for her to come in. So they're going to give you a temp screen at the door there, Kaylee. Okay. Okay, go. Yep, they'll screen you right there at the door and I'll, be, I'll come back for you, okay? Okay. She's going to go right in there and they're going to temp screen her right at the door. Don't go in, don't go in. And she said that's her gym teacher. <laughs> she was kind of embarrassed. She's like, that's my gym teacher. Okay, let's let her be. And what's lovely is that there's a protest just down the street and they have everything all blocked off. We're five minutes late for this appointment, which for some that's like, ooh, we're on time. But for me, that's like late. I don't like being late. Because I had to go way out and around to avoid the stupid protest. It's not stupid. I totally get it. They're over by the city hall. I have to think, where am I going? I'm going to go to the bank. Jason needs um, dollar bills and what, about, what else? Oh, I need cash for my hair appointment today. So I'm going to run and do that really quick, but with this extra um, roadblock. <laughs> taking me extra time to get around. What can I get for you? Yeah, can I get a large Coke and that's it? All right, dollar 10 first window, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys, I just got my hair cut. That is the pile of <laughs> hair. Can you believe it? All right, so it's, <laughs> it is so short, but it's not styled. I'm gonna go home and wash it, shower, or whatever. But it is so short. All right, you guys. So I love the length. I was a little cautious or a little, optim you know, pessimistic about the length when I first got done because it wasn't straightened. But I'm actually really liking it straightened. It feels really lightweight and um, really, really nice. I mean, it's still on my neck, but it's a lot lighter. So, but my kids just informed me of something that I'm actually really upset about. So I'm about to show you what it looks like from the back. And now I don't know what to do because this is why you don't have friends give you haircuts and she just drove home and lives 40 minutes away <sighs> so let me show you what it looks like from the back because I'm actually like legit upset okay is it really that bad yeah all right I feel so bad. She was so embarrassed. She came over and fixed it. I feel like, is it yeah. even? I don't 
don't know. I, don't, I still don't know. Okay, can you come and see if it looks good from the back, please? Oh, that's Kaylee. Abby, will you come down and see if it looks good from the back? She says it's fine. I don't know. All right, Abby, what do you think? Is it better? Yeah. <laughs> better than it was before? Uh-huh. So it's totally straight across. Does it look like a blunt cut across, or is it kind of blended in? It's blended. It's blended. Okay. In. All right. It's a lot better. <laughs> So I feel bad, but it does look a lot better. Look how much she had to cut off. All right, she had to cut all of that hair off in order to fix the problem, which is fine. She fixed the problem. All right, so I haven't even looked at it myself, so I'll have to look at it from <laughs> the footage here. But all right, what time is it? Dad tried to call me while she was cutting it. Yeah, he's done with working like 10 minutes. I don't know if I want to go to Ikea now. <laughs> it's kind of already been, oh, I didn't even tell you. Did I tell you guys? Ikea is open. Marshalls is open and Home Goods is open. So I'm super excited. But I think we've had an eventful day. So I think Jason actually said he wanted to go to Ikea with me, but he understood if I didn't want to wait until Monday when he has a day off because he thinks he's going to be too tired to go tonight. And I think I've had enough of a day. <laughs> so I haven't even like done any of my computer work. I have two videos now to edit, which we're going to talk about <sighs> videos and all that kind of stuff in another video. So stay tuned for that. But um, I'm going to send him the original, send Jason the original photo of my hair messed up. And then wait till he gets home to show him that it's actually fixed. I don't want to like spoil the fun for him. I'm going to let him like think that it's messed up for a little bit. And then we'll surprise him. Okay. All right. So Jason just got home. I want to get his initial reaction to my hair. Should we turn on some lights? I guess I have to like show you like this. Seeing my hair. Oh, he left. Okay, what do you think? We straightened it out since the photo I took sent to you. So she did fix it. It's a little lopsided this way. It kind of swoops. It needs to come up a little bit here. Okay, they said I had my head tilted when she looked at it like that. But does it still look? It's okay. It's <laughs> just like... It's exactly what we said. It's just... It's okay. It's kind of okay. It's, a, it's like a so, super cuts or like, you know, you're straight out of barber school. So. I know. I have... I just... I just picked that. Abby off. thought it was good from the front. Yeah, it I looks know. Kind we already from the front, but did they like thin well, it and do stuff, or is she it... thinned it? And I always get nervous about people thinning my hair because I've never found anyone but my hairstylist no in way. Utah. Sound like an eighty-year-old woman. I know. I am that person now know. that has my own. This is really it looks a little bit. Different. Sorry, you need to stop picking. You I know. Pick like a crack at it. <laughs> Thank you. Welcome home. I know. So. I kind of feel bad because I, I'm not completely satisfied with it. I actually sent photos to my hairstylist. And she's like, what the heck? That's a mess. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to, I don't know. I mean, it is what it is. I'm not going to have it get fixed again. Because, uh, what? I'm not going to get it. Oh, Jason says I have to look at the camera. I'm not going to get it fixed again. Because I don't want any more length cut off. At this point, we got to cut more length off in order to fix it some more. But I can do that. I know. Jason no. actually probably could have done them. Anyway, I have to kind of be careful because I don't want to offend anyone. If some of my friends watch this channel, <laughs> I've already had to send a text message to one of them. I'm like, can you just, you know what I'm talking about. You know who I'm talking about. Can you just kind of keep it to yourself? I don't want to offend anyone. It is what it is. She came over to fix it. But... So I'm gonna have to have it fixed when I go to Utah. Um, she's already, I haven't set an appointment yet because we don't know what, it, when or if we're gonna be able to go. Have to go stop all getting sick. Yeah, to Utah. Utah, my home state or my hometown is now the number one hotspot for the United States. Well, so. The US and made the Washington Post. Yeah, they're the national number one spot. So our chances of being able to go visit my that'll family are. That'll be the only are... time that happens. What? What did you say? I said that'll be the only time it's number one for anything. <laughs> Stop. Our school <laughs> gets number one for a lot we of stuff. We do have a good school. We do have a school. Good Stop. School, right? And yeah. it's, it is. I'm it just gets, talking smack. It, I'm sorry, but Cash Valley gets ranked for a lot of stuff in, in terms of like it's small a town. Place. I'm just doing the joke about like in the Fletch movies. Fun, but, Provo, but... two words I don't usually put together. <laughs> Well, we're not Provo people. No, it's not Provo. We I'm are not saying. BYU people at Utah, all. Utah's got so. a lot of jokes Can we do a fire tonight? 
and kids want to do a fire tonight at six o'clock. They've kind of been eating. You know what's nice about having teenagers? Let me show you what's nice. I came home from the getting my hair cut and Abby had made cookies oh, no. and other kids had, hang on one second, Jace. Other kids had made a smoothie. Wait, what? You said the dishwasher is leaking? Yeah. It just finished the load. Is it all wet over here? Yes, it's wet. Crap. Like sopping wet? Yeah, put yeah. your hand on there. Yeah, I'll hold it. No, I'll hold it. It's fine. It's Holy moly, clear out to here. Go right here. I was like just mold. putting my foot out and then oh, I fell crap. Like Seriously? Sitting there? I don't know what's going on. So do we need to pull it out? Yeah. yeah. Alright, so this load is not done yet. So I'm gonna cheat and I'm gonna set it up here. I'm gonna take this one out. No. No? No, I don't need to take that one out. I need to pull the whole machine out. I need to pull the whole machine out. I don't know, it was those little areas back there, but there's no way those gaskets would have failed already. So I'm not sure what's going on. So anyways, I'm gonna go change and then that's what I'm doing tonight, but I'm hungry, so I... All right, I'll you know, bring you something to eat. Thank you. Because I'm a good wife. I don't know what we're gonna find behind there. Water is not what I wanted. We need light. There's like a ton of water. Crap. Heck, where is it coming from? Okay, we gotta take everything out because I gotta pop it down and look at the attachments. Yep. Careful. I think you have to like pop it off of the track. Okay, we unloaded the top. It's not done yet. The load isn't done, so we couldn't just put it away. What is leaking? Did I just I have it? You didn't do that. Was that a pat like a patch they did? Been in the house for seven years. If this is the kind of patch job that people do. This looks like thread lock. So it's not really meant to do this, but I don't know if the pipe was wet because this was there. And I put thread lock on this. Right here? I don't know, it's all wet here. How can we test it? So I guess we're learning about all our appliances this quarantine, aren't we? Not exactly what we wanted to do tonight. So we're gonna start it. Let's see where the water, oh. Okay, it's leaking across the front because we still have water in the dishwasher. So, so now we've turned it on and we're trying to no, see. No, it's canceled drain. It's draining. Oh. But I would think that. That if it was still leaking and there's water flowing through it, that. Okay, right now it's draining. We canceled it. So it's clearly not the out pipe that's leaking. Okay, so now we're running it on a cycle but we're not seeing any water so far. So, who knows what's going on. From high. It's leaking from high? What do you mean? Okay, okay, okay. You can see it leaking? Yeah, get down here. Okay. So, All right. coming down out of here, it's coming up from here. Okay, we've got to just stop it, drain it. Is there, uh, from right here? This well, pipe right here? Well, there's it's dripping there, and plus it's dripping here, but it's coming. Oh, it's like we're right up here. From where? Oh crap. It's coming out of that leak. You can see where it's coming out though? Yeah. Okay, tell me what's wrong. So, I think there's other things going on. It's leaking from a gasket, which could probably be fixed. The problem is the elements went out on one of our earlier videos, you see that? I ordered a part exactly for this machine, Maytag. Uh, exact every, model number. Model number, everything, not a Chinese knockoff. And the problem is it's now melting the plastic, the bottom tub, and there's a leak. Like the plastic itself has a leak and it's leaking out. There's a hole in it. Yeah. I mean, except for trying to like paste little plastic back in there or something. I don't think there's any way to fix it because the tub itself is leaking. Pulled my hair up so I can work on this. Our kids don't need to go to college or anything, so fine. <laughs> They don't even need food next week at this point. <laughs> so we get to order a new dishwasher because there's no fixing the actual. Wait, 4th of July. 4th of July what? It's a great time to buy appliances. We can't wait a month. 
Okay, I'm gonna start looking into this because it is, that's when we got our fridge and our washer and dryer. Is the 4th of July sales at Lowe's? Because the guy even told us, we went and looked in April for those when we were gonna move into the house. And he's like, I'm gonna tell you a hint, wait a couple months and then come back and buy it when you're moving in your house. Because we kinda did it. We had like a really long escrow period. So, all right, so. Yeah. Yay. Yay. New dishwasher. All right, so we're at Lowe's, and now we have to decide what one we want. I would love to be able to just go with the lowest price, but I also want to get a good dishwasher. All right, yeah. We're deciding between these two. It's the same dishwasher here, and I like the look of this front one without the handle on it here. This one has a handle. Your hand's in the way. Um, and then show them what the inside, what one thing that we like on the inside. It has these little water bottle holders, but they also spray water up uh, into the cup. So it hits the cup and just totally washes it. Which is awesome. So we're trying to decide between this one, but with this front face, because I don't like the front face on this one. They all work the same level. But then this one, show them what it does. This one does on the inside. That's a little bit different. One, I love that. Uh, he likes the filter on this one. Well, it's filtered, but this thing goes. That one raises up. So you can do smaller dishes, you got bigger dishes, you go down. Yeah, I like that. Does this one over here do that, or no? No, I looked. Bummer. If we could have that with the, the cup sprayers and the front of this one, I'd be sold. But I think I would go over to this one instead, even though it's a little bit more. All right, so while we're waiting for him to look and see if they have our dishwasher, we're looking at wood tile floors. And I think we're gonna buy the samples. Is it like porcelain? So it looks like wood, but it's an actual porcelain tile. We like this one up here. I like that one the most. And then this one, and we decided this one is too, has too many white grains in it. So we're gonna buy the sample pieces. And this is 632, I think. Um, that's too, like, I don't know, it's too nude. All right, we got ourselves a dishwasher, and we got some, uh, what do you call it, baking soda? <laughs> Just because they had it. And then the tiles. Wait, who's that door open? What door is open? Your door open. Your door's open. Gotta shut the door. Stop. So we like Lowe's. They always help us. They um, they loaded it in and yeah, the guy helped us load it. And he was super nice. He was super like, nice, helpful. Went back and forth a couple times to help us get it. My throat is really dry, so I can't here, tackle I a, a lot more. I have a little bit more. of a drink left in here. Um, but anyways, we got it, and I guess we'll install it tonight. Well, we as in me. Oh, give um, me a break! I help. Stop! I help you. I'm not. Okay, whatever. I won't help you then, apparently. So what did we get? We got a General Electric? Um, yeah. Yeah, a GE, GE something. It was a nice, cool little cup thing. We uh, had to get the one with the handle, because they only had that one in stock. They didn't have the one that didn't have the handle. Um, and they we even looked like at stores that were like all the other stores. 15, store, 15 miles away. And at this time of night, I just didn't, it wasn't worth not having a handle. So, um, Anyway, I just, I don't want to do dishes by hand. And I'm okay with having a handle because we've had a handle for seven years. So it's totally fine. But it's a nice little night. Yeah, I'm gonna get a video of that. Yeah, it's a nice, it's a good temperature outside too. The girls are definitely gonna want to do a fire pit, but the problem is, well, we've got to get a If you can get in. the uh, fire pit going. Well, I'll they, do they can do it. Yeah. They got the good wood to do it, so. Yeah, but oh, that Jason didn't film going to get last night? The girls didn't want to be on film. You can get them without getting them. How do you think I've been doing it this whole time? All right. It's possible. So I we'll filmed show you Kaylee how we going installed. to the dentist today without filming Kaylee going to the dentist. I don't know how to film something <laughs> without filming it, so. Because <laughs> you're right. not skilled like me. Okay, we get to go home and um, install a dishwasher now. We are replacing and fixing all appliances and bathrooms. You, you need to change your angle, like angle up down a little bit, like, there you go. All right. 
We aren't changing all of our appliances. We fixed. Fixing. I said We're fixing. We are we changing changed. this one. And we fixed the stove. We fixed the stove. We're pulling carpet up, looking for mold, looking for leaks. Don't rear in the car. I'm not. He's going. Okay, turn the camera off. <laughs> turn the camera off. He's the worst backseat driver no, dude, ever. No, you were coming up on that car. He was going and I was not going to ram him. Turn the camera off. <laughs> Okay, old dishwasher Watch out. out. We did not pay to have it installed. We can do this, hopefully. I need you to find the instructions. Yeah, I know. The tubes. It come. So he's taking that one out. We have no idea how to get rid of a dishwasher. Okay, and then the here's the new one. All right, I don't know of any single home project that goes well. So this looks like it's going as well as it's going. So got Dishes there, doors off of cupboards, garbage, and under sink stuff, instructions, and missing parts. All right, we're testing the water going through. It was kind of hard because the connection down here with the extender wasn't matching up. We just need to make sure. And that needs to get taped back up, right? Yeah. Can you go get me some I tape? can go get you some new tape. That's the last of our problem. Go get you new tape. All right. So far, there's no. There's more tape on the floor. There's no leak. And power running. I know it was kind of difficult and frustrating, Jace, but you did a good job. It was difficult, and frustrating. Right? Yes. I'm. I'm acknowledging that. I know. It was hard. But it's worth saving the labor, and I appreciate. Oh, it's leaking. What? Where? Right there. Uh, oh, he said that it's actually like. Why? Why is it leaking down there? Okay, really getting sick of dishwasher is leaking, especially brand new ones. But I think it was just water that was already in there. The guy said yeah. that they wash them and they run a cycle right before they load them up in the boxes. Yeah. And that might have just been left over from that. So, because it was leaking right there and now it's not. Yeah. So, now let's just let it run its thing. It's so it's doing like a practice cycle or something? It's doing the smallest cycle I can figure out how to make it go. Oh, okay. <laughs> you guys, <laughs> this is taking a long time. We're putting two more screws to mount it to the cabinet. It is 11 o'clock. We have ordered pizza and still not finished um all four of our kids are mad at each other <laughs> it's not going well part of that comes from our stress and our chaos bleeds to them which is it happens so we're gonna hurry and finish this take showers and call it a night and i don't know if i have energy i'm gonna load these dishes but I, I might not actually care so again we forgot to put we forgot to put the foam on <laughs> had to unscrew the whole thing again this is kind of the story of how this has gone final kick plate going on and now I've washed these towels and another set twice today with all the water leaks all right now we just have extra area showing down there so we're just kind of wiping up the gunk down there. The floors are trashed and tons of dishes. So I made a deal with Jason. I'm gonna load these dishes so we can get them washed overnight. He's gonna put his tools away and then we're gonna call it a night. Glass. I knew it shattered earlier. I thought it had just it would actually shatter. But it's clearly just gotten a little shard and a crack. Ah! 
I'm done. I'm so done. Ow. There's another, what the heck? Okay, what do we got? Oh, there's, what the heck? Why is there glass on here? Okay, did you get all Yeah, now there's one on my other finger. Look. Can you tweet it? I see it. Yeah, I can't get them out now. I don't have a hand to get them out. Alright, so we are setting it on heavy because there's a ton of dishes in there. And I guess you have to set the bottle jet, which is, I think we showed you at the store, this little thing here. There's an actual jet right there. We should do it with That will go jars. up into, I know I've done all the jars that I can. The yeah. jars have the hardest time getting all the nooks. So, let's see what it turns out in the morning. Pretty fancy. No like leaks. Thank you. Yeah. It's almost midnight. Our kitchen is clean, but it's not clean. It's, the counters need to be washed. The floor is absolutely trashed. But guess what? It's almost midnight. I've only had two pieces of pizza since, I mean for dinner, but I haven't eaten since two o'clock this afternoon. Other than that, and I'm exhausted. I had a crappy haircut. Stress with kids fighting tonight and a dishwasher that's broken. So we're gonna call it a night. We will see you. I don't know when we're gonna see you. So you're gonna find out about that, our new schedule, soon. So stay tuned. Good night, guys. Thank you again, Jace. Yeah. If we had ice cream right now, he'd be getting ice cream. So what are you getting? Oh, good boy. He's getting watermelon. So take care, guys.